Peter Snowden joins us. And Pete, the uh, the new Pro Ride track, a great addition to the facilities here at Warwick Farm. Certainly is, Rich. Um, we've had an artificial track here before, but nothing to like this. Um, the last one was supposed to be an all-weather track, but we had problems from day one with it and um, worked through it with the problems. But this one, the profile of this track is outstanding. It was put in exceptionally well. Um, it's got terrific drainage and uh, should be here for a long time and uh, and do what it's supposed to do, be a good all-weather track. What was wrong with the, the previous one, Pete? Yeah, well, the, it just wasn't no base in it. The, the, the base was down, but the profile of the track was, I think, was about... Eight, uh, about eight mils, uh, sorry, eight, four inches thick, uh, which is way, way too thin. This one's about the old scale, about 16 or 18 inches deep. So that, that's a big difference to the profile of the track, and you get that feel walking on it. The last track, any jar you got, went straight back through the legs, and you know, there's continual problems with it. But this one here, there'll be none of that. It's it's uh, it's 18 inches of, of profile, and the, all that cushions will be there, will be there for a long time. It's it's just a very, very good track. You've seen this track uh, laid and obviously kept a close eye on it being put down. Yes, I watched every day of it and uh, I was amazed. Uh, there's one at Flemington and there's one at, I've got one at my farm and uh, it's nowhere near like this track. It's by far the best track that's been put down. Even the profile of it, just the sand, the compound of the mix is better. And um, they've even had a test pilot with a, a they flooded the track to see what it drained and as quick as it went in, it went out. So that's a good thing for later on through the, through the wetter months of winter. And it's got that little bit of cushion for, for all the horses? Yeah, very forgiving. I think it should be tremendous for young horses with shins to help them to help them cope and uh, for older horses with a bit of arthritis and knees and joints it should be very forgiving for them as well. Now having this track here obviously eases up the uh, the congestion on the other tracks. Yeah well, and it gives the grasses a chance which to, to recover because uh, we used to hammer them because it was the only thing we had to work our fast horses on uh, or fast work on uh, but now we've got this to take a bit of the, the workload off those grasses and to help them recover and uh, be a bit of, better surface for everyone. It's been a long time since the, uh, the money's been spent out here at the Warwick Farm and you've been a proud boy out Liverpool way for a long time. And things are really starting to progress out here at the farm, the facilities, I know the tie-up stalls, is things are really coming along. Yeah, it's, um, you, you, know, I like, you don't have to just whinge about it, but you know, it's often been said with the poor cousins out here and I, I, to a degree I think it's right. Um, the quality of horse and trainers out here are second to none. These guys know what they're doing and uh, we've worked under hardships for quite a while, but to see what we have now and even the, the trainers here out there, we've got room to move. There's, the, la the other one we had, you could swing a cat around in it and now we can fit ten of them out there and have a party, so it, it's, it's outstanding. But um, no, it's what the place needed. Uh, the tracks are good, the facilities are good and, uh, and the horse quality, it, it's always been here. I'm still tipping Billy Prane to get, get in your ear, even if it's his big joint out there. No, we've still got him in the other tower. We've got him segregated for the moment. It's not that much longer to last for, but he's there for, for a bit longer anyway. Warwick Farms, uh, it's starting to go all right, eh? Oh, it's tremendous, mate. It's always been good, but it's even better now. Well done, mate. Thanks, Rich.